we doing? We got everybody? We got 20 people? It is definitely a different experience coming into the school and the halls are empty. Then you find fun ways to take advantage of that, such as uh, skateboarding around these uh, empty hallways. <laughs> I don't feel totally isolated, but it's different. Not having the kids in here is, um, it does feel a little, the energy isn't there, obviously. We'll make the best of it, and there's a lot of cool opportunities tucked away in there. Remember I said sound effects help? So I kind of quickly had this shift of thinking that this is a different kind of opportunity. Um, I'll take what I can get from the kids and run with it. Last year, we got a 3D ceramic clay printer that prints clay. The filament is clay. It kind of seems like an opportunity has been given to us in that respect to have the time to figure this out. The kids, I, they, they took to the 3D design software and made things in different, so in different design programs, sent me the files, and now behind me here, we're um, starting to print out their projects that they did at home remotely when they do start coming in. They're coming into the studio space with work that they can touch, that they've made from home. Um, and they're pretty excited about that. It's a pretty fun thing. I want you guys to like, whatever you think you want to make, I want you to ask me how to do it. If you don't know, because I don't expect you guys to know how to do most of this stuff. I've talked to a lot of people about like having feelings of guilt because I feel so lucky to have like a really great job um, that's dependable right now. I'm not suffering. And then being in a really good community, both um, where I live and where I work here at this school district, um, being like a really strong community um, of peers and coworkers, um, super supportive and um, excited for um, making new things happen. These are trying times, but they're times to try new things.